evening, everyone. This is Chris Saraga for the 365. I am down in beautiful Oroville, California, right near the Feather River. As always, I'm at what I love to call the Rock House, but it was actually the Feather River Nature Center on a beautiful June 8th, 2017. And the reason I'm uh, quoting the date today is today is the day my son graduates from high school. So this cast might be a little short because I am trying to rush to make sure that we get dressed and changed and everything. And I'm going to be covering that a little bit too. So you might, there might be some bonus footage on the end of this or more than likely on a whole nother one that shows the, uh, Orville High School graduation of 2017. So I'm very excited about that. Uh, kind of the whole point of why we're going to Barbados is it's a graduation trip for him. He has made it. Uh, it was, it seemed like it would be a near thing a couple times, but that's not actually the case. He actually did really good in school. So I just want to say congratulations, Dante. This is your dad. Thank you very much for graduating. You've been an awesome son so far. I can't see uh, what the next hundred years hold for you. Anyway, now that that's out of the way, um, right behind me is the, what is that? The waterfall for the fish hatchery. Jeez, it's terrible getting old. Waterfall for the fish hatchery. And behind that is the gates for the diversion dam right there. So, and let's pan you around a little bit here. Table Mountain right up there. Right across the way is the fish hatchery itself. I love this area. I'm down, down here a lot. This is where my whole uh, cast, where the 365 actually began. Let me show you. As you can see, the river is kind of foamy today. Still don't have an official explanation on the foam. I have some theories myself that it's the uh, algae that when the water is raised and then it goes back down, that you have algae on the edge of the edge of the river that gets brought back out and it's foamed up so this area down here is now on this side of the feather river is now open for travel so there's actually a trail you can walk all the way up to there's a gate just before the spillway itself but it's about three miles that you can walk up there up past the diversion pool through the old old train tunnel that's up there and all that area up there so it's great we've got uh, as as Orville recovers we're getting a lot more um, trails opened up a lot more areas um, that we can see there'll be some bonus footage on the end of this um, just a uh, quick pan of the area around here where I'm actually standing and where I'm actually standing right now let's see if I can get this new device to do this for me is there we go on a rock way way above the Feather River now, I don't mind water, it's not good for me, but I really don't like heights. So I'm a little precarious right now, a little strange for me to be up so high, but I'm okay with that. Um, so tomorrow, I'll be, uh, there'll be some extra footage for you guys. I don't wanna give away where I'll be, but um, it's gonna be, it's exciting for me. It's a place I have not been before and that I had to actually study about. I didn't know anything about it when I, when I found out. So you'll have that tomorrow. Um, we're gonna do some special Barbados coverage as I've been saying this last week. Got some new logos I'm making. Got some, uh, a whole bunch of equipment I'm taking. I'm gonna show you guys that equipment. There's. Um, gonna be so I'll be still be doing the cast obviously I won't be doing it from beautiful Oroville but I'll be doing it from uh, beautiful Barbados so I, it'll have a little bit of the river totals and all that stuff but mostly where we're at in Barbados because I just thought all you guys might really enjoy seeing a whole nother country and we're not just going to Barbados we're going to some other Caribbean islands too um, top on my mind is uh, St. Lucia which I've always wanted to go to uh, St. Kitts which I know very little about uh, and then also San Juan, Puerto Rico, which I'm really excited about that too, because I know I can fly the drone there because they're under US laws there. And I'm not sure if I can fly the drone on all those islands. There's a couple that I know I can. Uh, there's a, I'm, I'm not so sure about a few and there's one I know I can't. So you'll get some drone video from some, some steady cam video from the others, just seeing some beautiful places. Uh, all of our antics I'm taking, it's me and about 10, uh, I'm sorry, eight other people that are going with me, eight, nine other people. So you'll see all of our antics there's a bunch of teenagers going so it should be pretty fun anyway that is what i have for you guys today 
As always, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing. Make sure that you uh, tell all your friends about it, especially if they want to see Barbados and that area. That one's going to, we're all really excited about doing that. Not only going on the trip, but bringing it to all you guys too. So thank you. Have a wonderful day. And as always, I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.